More than two years since the start of the pandemic, COVID remains a public health threat. Over the past 14 days, COVID cases in the U.S. are up 15 percent. Hospitalizations are up 20 percent. Here's CBS's Joy Benedict. COVID summertime surge is catching many off guard. Scientists say the Omicron subvariants responsible for 97% of new infections nationwide didn't even exist last year, concerning many. Do you know a lot of other people who are catching COVID? Oh, definitely. My school recently, they dropped the mask mandate and everybody started getting it. BA5 is spreading rapidly across the U.S., with about 75% of Americans living in a high or medium COVID risk area. Hospitalizations are also rising, especially in the Southwest, because of this dominant strain. It's the B5 variant that's growing. It has the capacity to evade the immunity that we've acquired from vaccination and also from prior infection. It Dr. Scott Gottlieb says there's also an undercount of Omicron cases, because many who home test do not sell report. There's over 100,000 cases on average being reported. We're probably detecting one in 10 infections right now, so it's probably more like a million. Health experts continue to urge Americans to get vaccinated and take other COVID precautions, including masking. In Los Angeles County, health officials could be less than two weeks away from requiring masks indoors. If the hospitalizations are going up, it's expected that mask mandate will come back. So I'm not really worried, and I think people are used to the mask by now. Now here in Los Angeles County, almost 75% of people are fully vaccinated. And although an Omicron specific uh, vaccine is expected sometime this fall, doctors say if you're eligible to get the shot, just get one.